Mr. Speaker, pursuant to Clause 2A1 of Rule 9, I seek recognition to give notice of my intent to raise a question of the privileges of the House. The form of the resolution is as follows. A resolution censuring Representative Rashida Tlaib for anti-Semitic activity, sympathizing with terrorist organizations, and leading an insurrection at the United States Capitol complex. Whereas in May 2019, Rashida Tlaib said that she celebrated the Holocaust and felt a calming feeling when thinking about the genocide of millions of Jews. Whereas in 2020, Rashida Tlaib retweeted an illustration with the caption, from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. And this Palestine Liberation Organization PLO slogan has been adopted by Hamas and calls for the elimination of Israel and death to all Jews. Whereas in September 2022, Rashida Tlaib, as a member of the Congressional Progressive Caucus, displayed her disdain for Israel, saying, you cannot claim to hold progressive values, yet back Israel's apartheid government. Whereas instead of denouncing the horrors of Hamas, slaughtering Israelis, and demanding the release of all hostages held by Hamas, Rashida Tlaib stated on October 8, 2023, the path to the future must include lifting the blockade, ending the occupation, and dismantling the apartheid system that creates the suffocating, dehumanizing conditions that can lead to resistance. Whereas Rashida Tlaib exhibited her hatred for America by reposting a message on October 12, 2023, blaming America for allowing the deaths of Palestinian babies at the hands of Israel. Whereas Rashida Tlaib led an insurrection at the United States Capitol Complex on October 18, 2023, which put members of Congress, their staffs, and Capitol visitors in danger by shutting down elevators, stairwells, and points of egress while obstructing official business in both the House of Representatives and the Senate, including a for Senate Foreign Affairs Committee hearing. Whereas the insurrection led by Rashida Tlaib was organized by Jewish Voice for Peace, which the Anti-Defamation -Defama League calls a radical anti-Israel activist group that advocates for a complete economic, cultural, and academic boycott of the state of Israel, and that believes Israeli policies and actions are motivated by deeply rooted Jewish racial chauvinism and religious supremacism. Whereas members of the Southern Poverty Law Center, a far left nonprofit organization, were present at the insurrection at the Capitol on October 18, 2023. Whereas several insurrectionists at the Capitol belong to a group messaging chat called Global Intifada, which is the Arabic word for rebellion or uprising and refers to a series of protests and violent riots carried out by Palestinians and Israel during the last century. Whereas by leading an anti-American and anti-Semitic insurrection on October 18, 2023, Rashida Tlaib followed Hezbollah's orders to carry out a day of unprecedented anger following an explosion at a Gazan hospital lying about Israel's responsibility for the attack which United States intelligence agencies said was not perpetrated by Israel. And whereas members of Congress who denounce the United States while praising terrorist organizations are unfit to hold office. Now therefore be it resolved that Representative Rashida Tlaib be censured. Representative Rashida Tlaib forthwith present herself in the well of the House of Representatives for the pronouncement of censure, and Representative Rashida Tlaib be censured with the public reading of this resolution by the Speaker. I yield back, Mr. Speaker.